Hi, and welcome to Base Trends TV show, Season 6, Dapped Forward Thinkers. My name is Enyuna. This dress I'm wearing is sponsored by Cluttered Boutique. She's an Awoshi. You can call her number right there on the screen. And many thanks to Sophia for giving me this beautiful look. I'm so much happy with it. And of course, um, this season on Base Trends, we've introduced a new segment, Dapped Hashtag Trending Ventures. Yes, we are putting the spotlight and encouraging young entrepreneurs who are picking up certain line of ventures that really graduate like themselves might not want to have gone into that venture. But we don't know what inspired them to take up such uh, businesses. So we want to talk to them, encourage them, put a spotlight on them for others who are home and are not working and are still looking forward to a quite color job that, hey, if she is doing it, of course, you can also do it. Many thanks to my sponsors. Without them, this trends will not be here. Vanguard Assurance, we always stand by you. I'm urging you that, look, if you're traveling abroad, you have your property, you have your car, and you want to take an insurance policy, just want to Vanguard Assurance. Um, the hard office is at reach, and they will take care of you and give you that good policy. And remember, they pay their claims promptly, even through mobile money. Yes, that's how uh, good Vanguard can be. National Pensions Regulatory Authority, NPRA, is encouraging all employers and employees that, look, if you're working and you're not, pay you're not paying your contributions or your uh, employer is not paying for you, try and walk to their offices and they'll make sure that he pays for you or you start paying yourself so that when you go on pensions, you can have a stress-free life. It's very important. Live to mantle paste. During this festive season and this new year, throughout to Easter and then through Christmas again, your jollof rice, your gravy, your light soup can only taste better. Delicious if you're using leaf tomato paste to make that food. So remember that if you want an in bulk pages, you can equally contact the number on your screen and they will take good care of you. Novelty Innovations, many thanks so much for streaming all our episodes that we um, air every now and then on TV. JNG Insurance Brokers, thank you so much for holding us down. If you want a person or an institution that can give you advice, on what policy is good for your property or how to beat down the discount when you go to take all those policies. Remember to contact Dr. Gideon Amenedo and he will give you that advice on which policy works for whatever product it is you want to take up. My name is always Enyonam. I love you so much. Thanks for staying with us. Remember this season, I have a lot of beautiful, fantastic prizes I'll be giving away on Best Trends TV show. Just say glue to your seat and watch us every weekend on your TV. Saturday morning, 10.30 sharp, I'm on air. So like I'm saying, cleaners perform a variety of uh, cleaning maintenance um, services or duties in our residences and our company just to keep it clean and in good condition so you can go and sit down comfortably and do your work or rest home without thinking of cocoa cheese and pests and all that. Now there's this young lady who has taken it upon herself to venture into cleaning. Her name is Sandra Ifa. She's the CEO of Global Cleaning Services. And the wonderful part is that we all sat in the same class in JE. We were trained as journalists. So I don't know how she ended up becoming um, a cleaning person or I mean started a cleaning business, but she's here. Before I engage her in this interactive interview, let's go for a quick break. When we come back, the main interview begins. Stay and stay, I'll be right back. Oh, 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 oh. And you know, my claim is not covered by the insurance policy I arranged. 
Parkwaysi, I've always advised you to let J in J Insurance Brokers, the insurance professional, handle your insurance to avoid gaps. At J in J, we analyze your insurance needs, we arrange cover with the best insurer with a track record of prompt claims payment, and above all, we facilitate and negotiate your claims. Call Dr. Gideon Amenedo, the CEO, on 0244-333335 or 0504-333335. You can also email him, Gideon, at jnginsurancebrokers.com or visit our website, jnginsurancebrokers.com. Thank you very much, Ayunam. I'm calling doctor right away. At JNG Insurance Brokers, Negotiating a great insurance deal is our business. Waitress! Tomato paste when I'm with the Adrian. I don't want to leave tomato paste in Ghana. This is what I call a journey. <laughs> Secret nani L E A P leap. Say one when him say leap tomato paste the journey there. It was superb and palatable taste. Na esu obi aso. There were large and small sizes for chop bars, restaurants, and a few few. For bulk purchase, contact 033-2095314 or 050-1410185. Welcome back. This is Base Trends TV show season six, dubbed Forward Thinkers. And this particular segment is dubbed Hashtag Trending Ventures. Thank you so much, Sandra, Thank you, for joining me on Base Trends. Thank you for having me. How have you been? I'm doing so well. Okay, so it's been like eight years now after JE. Yes, it was I'm, 2011, I'm sure. right? 2011, yes. 2011, 2011 to yes. 20, was we, we did two years. Two before. years, 29 to 2011. Okay, and then that was it. Yes. You've been busy. Baby, marriage, and all that. Congratulations, sweetheart. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> all right, Sandra, so let's start. Now, I was wondering how come a journalist became a cleaner, or a journalist turned into a cleaner. So tell me, how and when did you develop the desire to go into cleaning? Okay, so right after GE, mm -hmm. um, we did national service. Right. And then we came back to GIJ to do our degree. Okay. So after the degree, we went back looking for a job, mm -hmm. and then there was no job, like white colored job. Right. So um, working in Accra, I realized that there were a lot of upcoming long buildings right. coming up. So I was wondering who was cleaning the place. Mm -hmm. Even though in my mind, I realized that there are cleaners, professional cleaners around. I thought, I thought it wise to come up with a cleaning company. So that was the first thoughts that came in mind. And also, naturally, I'm a neat person, I'm someone who likes cleaning. Mm -hmm. I remember where I stay with my mom, it's a long story building. We clean from the fifth floor to the first floor. And we don't get tired. Okay. So, cleaning is, is me. I'm it's cleaning. It's your passion. Yes. You love it. Yes. You enjoy cleaning. I, I eat cleaning. <laughs> <laughs> now, share with me your first experience when you received that call from a client that, hey, uh, Sandra, you and your team, can you come over to my residence or my office to clean for me? How was that experience for you? Okay, so the first experience mm -hmm. was when I started global cleaning. Right. And then it was all over my WhatsApp. Mm -hmm. I, I told friends to right. post it. So I was there in a certain place. I had a call from a friend mm. who said, no, my, 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 my company, mm -hmm. it's actually a, a, clin a clinic, okay. wants someone to clean the place. Mm -hmm. Can you take that offer? And <laughs> the price was really bad. It was that bad. But a friend told me that if you don't want to work for small, mm -hmm. you don't get a salary. Mm. So I said, no, I'll do it. Okay. So I had 
a friend or a sister, also a friend. I told her about it. So we had to. Then we went to the clinic in Dansoman. Right. It had a lot of consulting rooms, a lot of ward. Really, mm -hmm. it was so hectic. Okay. But we were able to do it and they were so happy that we did it. Right. So I guess you were not expecting that, right? But you got there and it was like, wow. Oh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> do you have a choice? Than no. to go and own and then perform your job. Uh, no, no, no. I didn't have a choice at right. that time because I accepted the offer. Okay. So when I went mm -hmm. and I look at well, how much they are paying me mm -hmm. and how much, how many rooms are there to be cleaned? Outrageous. Okay. So I had to do it. Right. Now that brings me to how you manage to stay fit physically to be able to perform all these tasks. Because trust me, cleaning is not that simple. You tell lift you. things, you climb things, you do I that and do that. You. As a family person, how do you manage to stay fit so that you can be healthy and move about doing all the cleaning every day? Okay, um, the job itself mm -hmm. is an exercise. Right. So <laughs> that even makes me f keep fit. Mm. But naturally, I pray to God to give me natural strength right. to be able to handle that task. Okay. And then I eat well. Okay. I eat well so that I can be smart mm. to be able to clean right. because if i'm so big mm -hmm. i can't clean okay yes i see you've lost some weight yes you're looking good <laughs> now, <laughs> now what, share with me some of your most um embarrassing or frustrating moment ever since it's been one year right it's been one year. congratulations thank you global cleaning is one year already yes some of your most frustrating or challenging moments ever since you started this this period of um cleaning okay um the second contract mm -hmm. um was a real estate company mm -hmm. and then they had uh, an apartment somewhere in Oyarifa. Right. so they called and then and then they said I should come and then look at the place and then give them the price and mm -hmm. all that I don't have a car okay so how do I get there they sent me a Google map right so I followed the Google map mm -hmm. I got a certain junction I actually had to use the car I used walking in the google map and they showed me a certain distance it was about one hour trekking i had Ooh. to trek and we were about three people and then we we're just trekking we keep asking i was so tired i was like look let's leave this thing and let's go they were like no push up go forward you will still meet the place mm -hmm. we use one hour mm -hmm. to just find a, find a certain well, location that was so close to us right. we kept moving up mm -hmm. and down mm -hmm to one particular location okay. it was so embarrassing, right. it was so frustrating. I see, but you still have to go and do the work. Yeah, I did it and they even gave me another three apartments to oh, handle. Oh, so you see, if you had gone back, you would have lost that. I tell you, my I sister. I see. You are still watching Best Trends TV show. My name is Enyonam. I'm chit-chatting with Sandra Ifa. She's the CEO for Global Cleaning Services. And this particular segment is hashtag Trending Ventures. This line of business, as some of them, you know, graduates like this will not look for such jobs. But let's go for a break. When we come back, there is more after this. Take care and stay. Hi. In recent times, it has come to my notice that a lot of Ghanaians invest because of interest rates. There's no problem with that. Of course, you need a return and that's why you're investing. However, investing is not just about the rate. There are certain questions you need to ask. It is said that the risk-free interest rate, which is the Government of Ghana Treasury Bill, is usually your benchmark. So, when you go to a firm, that promises to give you a return higher than the interest rate the higher they go the more questions you must ask because it's likely the riskier the investment is so you've got to ask where are they placing the money what type of investment are they making who is regulating them and indeed you must take one step further and call this regulator and ask questions about the company whether they are filing their returns whether they are meeting all the policies, procedures and laws. You also have to check how transparent the company is with information. When you are asking the questions, 
are they willingly giving you the answers or not it's very very important that you find out things yourself rather than rely on what a friend or a family member has said because they do not always have the full facts find out the facts yourself before you invest so that when you invest you know you've invested wisely invest wisely invest with data bank Welcome back for that quick commercial break. It's still Best Trends TV show. My name is Enyo Nam. Follow this program on all social media platforms, Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter as Best Trends TV show. If you want to send us any question, your thought, and your views, just feel free and share would come back to respond to it. And of course, there are some giveaways that you won't be receiving if you are a constant and regular viewer of the show. And thank you so much, Sandra. Cheers, cheers, cheers. Oh. Cheers to your one year. Cheers. <laughs> uh, many thanks to uh, Barry Smoothest. He's on social media. You can um, search for him and all your events. If you want smoothies, shawarma, all the warmers, just call him and he'll get you sorted. Sandra, yeah. before we went on break, I asked you if this one year period of going into cleaning, whether or not it has paid off. I love what I do, mm -hmm. so I don't really, of course it's business, so you look for money. Okay. But because I'm new in the system, mm -hmm. um, it doesn't really pay that big, mm. but it's paying. Okay. It's paying. Not that big, so it's worth but it. it's paying. Oh, it's, it's worth, worth it. it. Yes, absolutely. It nice is. Nice one. It is. Right. Um, I also want to know, um, for this past one year, you have to work in this industry. It's a lot of work. It's a, it's a work that you come across different clients with different requests, different attitude or behaviors. Um, was, that, was that been any one point in time that your patients, as someone rendering service, had been put to test? And how did you react? Oh, <laughs> yeah. Um, there was one instance. Okay. No, there have been many instances, not right. one. Okay. But then uh, the one that my patient was really tested mm -hmm. was when we had a big, a massive building mm -hmm. to handle, mm -hmm. about seven bedrooms mm -hmm. to handle somewhere around um, Hacho. Okay. So we went there with my team. We cleaned from morning to evening mm -hmm. and we were still cleaning. Mm -hmm. It was about 8 p.m. and we were cleaning. We went there around 6. We were cleaning to 9, 9 p.m. Ooh. So, after we were done, right. it was so late, so the woman just paid us and then we left. Mm. Two days later, I was somewhere and I had a call. Oh, uh, the work you did, it wasn't nice at all. Please, please come back and come and do it well. I said, okay, madam, don't get worried, I'll be back with my team. So we went there. Apparently, mm -hmm. a painter, after we cleaned, mm -hmm. a painter went there to clean paints all paint. over right. and then you got some drops on the floor yeah. so because of the drops on the floor mm -hmm. the woman can't say oh my painter came around you know you she will pay extra money okay. so she was like oh these paints were there already so how come you didn't take it off so the painter i had big issue with the painter <laughs> because i anytime i do my cleaning i take videos of it so okay. I, I had uh, um, evidence that evidence, proves you yes, actually did your proves. work well so he said, yes, yes, I had mm. to paint, so mm. you people, I'm sorry. Mm. And my patience was tested. I, 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 told her, I told him what I don't want. Right. After that, he even gave us money. Oh, I see. For what he did. Right. Mm. Interesting. He gave my girls money. Okay. Sandra, you would agree with me that there are a lot of other cleaning companies. Yes. There absolutely. are people who have been there for five years, ten years. You were just a baby, one year old. How were you handling or staying in competition? Okay. Um, because as you said, I'm a baby, right? My price mm -hmm. keeps me going. Okay, I take I don't take much. Mm -hmm. I, um, I always tell my girls that look, there are a lot of big, big companies with big machines. Mm. We usually do hard work, okay? Even though some of the floor cleaners are there, like they can clean, but they can't really take stains mm. off. Sometimes we use we sit down, mm -hmm. we use manpower mm -hmm. at a particular place, we mm -hmm. can really sit. And then scrub the place well. Mm. Yes, with wire, you know, wire for a lot. But um, our pricing, 
Yes, our price. People call us because of our price. Mm -hmm. We are not that special. Mm -hmm. We have other big companies mm -hmm. there. That's our price. So, um, someone who is into cleaning, somehow, somehow, you need to know a little bit of moving things from here and that and seeing this and that suggest to the person why don't you move it to this angle or that angle um at what point in time have you moved to a facility or a company and you saw a few things and you're like you know what let me put my thinking cap on and suggest to this person and how was the feeling like what was the feedback from the client that oh sandra um thank you for telling me to move this here have you done that before yes i have um we work with a particular rural estate. Okay. Yes, so we went there to clean an apartment right. and they, they were about to fix an air condition mm -hmm. at the hall. Mm. But where they, they were fixing the air condition was not too pleasant. I okay. was asking the foreman, mm -hmm. look, if the person is going to sit this way, and the air condition is that mm. way, mm. wouldn't it be blowing the person? Right. Why don't you fix it that way? So they thought of it, they were like, oh, okay, Sandra, this is good. We mm. would fix the air condition there that way we, they also had some flower pots that they've arranged mm -hmm. there and after cleaning when we're arranging mm -hmm. the place we rearrange the place okay another, another way right. and we like them the right. way we arrange the okay place. so once in a while you do stuff like that and yes, people yes, appreciate yes, it yes, okay yes, that's nice um in my introduction i did said cleaning you are not the first to start cleaning no no I cleaning am. has been there for a very long time but after your service you looked for job around and you were not finding one. Yes, you decided yes. to create one and also employ others yes. who are working for you. Mm -mm. But you know every profession comes with some kind of respect it is accorded to. Where you found yourself? As a cleaner, that's how we call you. Hey, sign that way. Uh, do you think you and those of you in this industry have been accorded that needed respect that you need to? Yeah. Before you answer that, let me go for a quick break. When I come back, think carefully about this and tell me whether or not you think you are being given the deserving respect that you need to have. It's all based on TV show. My name is Enyo Nam, and this is the season six. Uh, this particular segment is hashtag trending ventures, putting a spotlight on certain lenient ventures or businesses that some kind of people or graduate will say, wait, dear me, yeah. But she is doing it. She's a graduate. I completed or graduated with her. She's doing it and she's doing it so well. And it's paying off. That's what she's saying. When we come back, we'll wrap up the interview. Stick and stay. I'll be right back. Welcome to Kwame Showbiz Boutique. We are located at Achimota Neoplan adjacent the Melcom. For all kinds of events, weddings, award ceremonies, parties, engagements, just walk to our boutique. We have all kinds of clothes, very quality but affordable. We work from Monday to Saturday from 7 a.m. to 8 p.m. You can also call us on the number displayed on your screen. Follow us on all social media platforms Kwame Showbiz Boutique. Kwame Showbiz Boutique, West African best kept secret, including. back to you I asked because really I don't know how it's going to be like for a graduate and just imagine I call you and I you are cleaning my hand hey Sandra hi Sandra hi Sandra you know how does it feel do you think you're being accorded that respect that you deserve okay for my line of business mm -hmm. I've never encountered that okay. respect right immediately you call me mm -hmm. <laughs> it's the way you carry yourself, mm. please. Mm. The way I talk to you on mm -hmm. phone. <laughs> I know you know this, this person is a graduate. Mm. 
I, I just don't talk to you anyhow. Mm -hmm. I give you the right words you should hear, mm. and I don't. I, I can sometimes speak tree with you, mm -hmm. but the way I even speak the tree with you, in your, in the phone or on the phone, sorry, mm -hmm. you will know this person knows what she's about. Okay. So how I carry myself when I even come to your home, the way I greet you, the way I talk to you, I've never truthful. I want to be truthful. Okay. I've never encountered that, right. and my competitors too. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I don't think no one has even encountered okay. that. Now let's talk about um, the kind of machines you use in this line of business. Because mm -hmm. I have visited a company that provide the solutions or the detergents you use during this cleaning. Yes. And I saw a lot of heavy, heavy machines, Fake industrial nice. machines that yes. are being used. Yes, um, yes. How did you come up? How easy or difficult was it for you to be able to purchase these uh, machines in your business? Uh, as a startup, yes. how did you raise the funds? Okay. Um, we, we are still buying machines, okay. but um, we use our funds. Okay. Funds, I use some of my NSS money to, I save them, mm -hmm. I, I had their savings. Mm -hmm. So I bought machines, okay. some few machines, the vacuum right. cleaner, okay. the um, stain extractors. Mm -hmm. I bought, I bought, I have a grinding machine. Mm -hmm. I bought all that for my NSS money. Right. I've been working as a contract somewhere. Okay. So I was also saving mm -hmm. for that. Mm -hmm. Um, we are still coming. I can't say we have all the machines mm. available. No, we have machines to buy, mm. big machines to mm -hmm. buy, and we are still saving for that. Okay. I wanted to also ask you about your long-term plan. Everybody's um, idea or vision and mission is for his brand or company to cross the borders of Ghana. Best trends have been in South Africa last year. Yes. And so this so. year we'll be going to Europe. Yeah, Hello, amen. Europe. Be expecting best trends. So, what is the long-term plan for you? Where are you seeing global cleaning services? Okay, um, like like we do. Mm -hmm. Um, if you are thirsty, you go for water. Mm. So, if you want a cleaner, mm -hmm. you go for global cleaning mm -hmm. service. Mm -hmm. That's what I want global cleaning service to get to. Okay. If it comes to cleaning, mm -hmm. the thought should be global cleaning service. Okay. If you are hungry, what do you look for? Food. Yeah. So, if you want a cleaner, global cleaning service. Right. It should be in the mind of every Ghanaian. Mm -hmm. That if you need a cleaner, oh, mm -hmm. go for global cleaning service. Right. Their prices are good. Okay. They work very well. Right. It's neat and fantastic. Awesome. How was the support or the feedback like from your mom, dad, siblings? When you said, I'm going to clean, you clean, you go for free. I mean, what was the response like? And, and how has it been so far for this one year? They know I'm a go getter. Mm -hmm. Because of what I'm doing, my brother named a child after me. Oh, okay. Um, to get a graduate mm -hmm. and then say, I'm going to clean someone's mm -hmm. house. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Sometimes they think of it, they say, wow. Um, the support there has been there from day one. Okay. I do other things. Right. Yes. Global cleaning serves actually in three forms. We okay. do the industrial cleaning, mm -hmm. we do office cleaning as right. well. And then sometimes we do house help, that's on a low key. Okay. So it's been, it's been phenomenal. Like it's right. been fantastic. Right. Awesome. So now we're about to wrap up the interview. Yeah. It's already 30 minutes. Yeah. And. Um, your last words for the young ones who want to start up something mm -hmm. and then they are waiting for a huge amount of money to mm -hmm. start up mm -hmm. i'm telling you that look whatever you have start something i didn't start global cleaning service this way um, way back after national service right. i was doing some earrings business okay. i moved from earrings to mm -hmm. ice blog right. to global cleaning mm -hmm. service so whatever you want to do just start something small mm -hmm. that will fetch money right. then you save it then you look for another thing Yes, then you save it. And mm. Global Cleaning Service, you're on Facebook. Okay. If you go to Global Cleaning Service, on Facebook, you will see. Just mm. type Global Cleaning mm. Service. Instagram, we are Global Cleaning Service 2024. Mm. We are there. If you type Global Cleaning Service 2024, mm. you see us. We are on YouTube, Global Cleaning Service. Everywhere you go, we are there. Right. Just type Global Cleaning Service. Right. And she will come. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so there you have it. This is how we wrap up on uh, today's segment, Hashtag Trending ventures, yes, trending ventures. These ventures have been there for long. She's not the one to start, but she took it up and she's doing it better than some people who have already been there. Sandra Ifa, she is the brain behind Global Cleaning Services. I believe you've enjoyed the interview. Thank you, Tema Sandra. Thank you for having I me. I really appreciate your time. I'll see you around the corner. Yes, yes. <laughs> we'll yes. meet Ajayi again for our home call. <laughs> <laughs> so if you want one of these 
delicious. Um, did you enjoy it? Yes, very nice. I love the ginger. You know, take yours and let, let, let's cheers again to Global Cleaning Services. Yeah. And uh, if you want to one of this for your party, your wedding, just contact Berry's Smoothies. He's on Instagram and, and he'll get you sorted. Until then, it's a bye for now. Bye-bye.